the Baltic region has faced increasing security challenges, prompting NATO to prioritize its defense posture there. To address these concerns, Lithuania will benefit from a rotational deployment of air defense systems from three NATO allies, starting next year. This initiative, confirmed by Lithuanian Defense Minister Lorinas Kasiunas on Zinia Radija's radio, is a significant step toward maintaining a steady and near-continuous presence of NATO's air defense capabilities in the Baltics. The rotation, approved by NATO in response to rising security tensions in the Baltic Sea region, underscores a commitment to support the Baltic states in lieu of permanent air defense installations. The Netherlands has already confirmed its involvement, deploying its Patriot systems for exercises at Shaole Air Base this past summer during the Baltcon 24 exercise. This deployment demonstrated the Netherlands' commitment to enhancing Lithuania's defensive capabilities and exemplified the benefits of the rotational model for the region. While the Netherlands is confirmed as one of the contributing nations, other countries likely to participate include Germany and the United States. Both possess advanced Patriot systems with capabilities suited to defend against modern aerial threats. France, with its SAMP-T systems, is another potential candidate. Speculation also surrounds Sweden's possible involvement, given its strengthened military ties with Lithuania through recent acquisitions, such as the CV-90 infantry fighting vehicles. However, Cassiunas has refrained from confirming Swedish participation at this stage. Alongside NATO's rotational deployments, Lithuania is taking substantial steps to strengthen its national air defense. Two recent agreements with European defense manufacturers reflect this commitment to a more robust and independent defense infrastructure. 1. RBS-70NG system from Saab Dynamics Asterisk signed on October 1, this €130 million Euro deal with Saab Dynamics provides Lithuania with additional short-range air defense systems, the RBS-70NG. These portable missile systems are effective against low-altitude aerial threats, offering Lithuania greater flexibility and responsiveness in addressing security concerns. 2. NASM system from Kongsberg Defense and Aerospace Asterisk In an effort to boost its medium-range air defense, Lithuania advanced the acquisition of the NASM system by seven years. Originally scheduled for 2030, the project has been fast-tracked to 2024, secured through additional funding totaling 234 million euros. NASAMs will significantly enhance Lithuania's mid-range air defense capabilities, closing gaps in the nation's overall aerial threat response. This joint NATO and Lithuanian initiative aims to ensure an active strategic defense network across the Baltic states. With the Netherlands and potentially other allies rotating their systems, the Baltic region will benefit from enhanced protection against emerging threats. Lithuania's acquisitions are particularly aligned with NATO's collective security framework, emphasizing a balance between allied support and national capability. The rotational air defense deployment not only represents NATO's commitment to the Baltic region, but also demonstrates Lithuania's strategic vision for self-reliance and improved regional stability. As these defense enhancements take shape, they reflect a cohesive approach to addressing shared security challenges in the face of evolving threats across the Baltic Sea region.